Hi, Cheryl. Yes, I've, I've become a bit weak. I'm using the umbrella for a light rain shower. Let's face it. All right. You know, it's cool out here. We've had some wind gusts going on. We've got some rain showers and this pattern's going to stick around, oh, for a couple days yet until it kicks out of here in time for the weekend, time for the beach by then. How about that? 79 is our average high. Our sun sets tonight at 815, rose this morning at 557 if you were around. If not, that's why I'm here to tell you about it. 61 is our current temperature. Winds gusting to 22. Those are going to pop up a little bit. Gusts maybe 25 to 30 at times through these afternoon hours. Sustained at 15. And the winds will be a bit gustier, of course, along the Chesapeake Bay. And we've got some tidal flooding and things like that to talk about here in just a brief moment. Uh, there's our current wind speed. And you can see that direction out of the northeast. Sustained at 15. 13 to 15 along the bay there. But if you live there, it probably feels a bit stronger. I often get calls from folks saying, man, the winds out here are something else, way different from what you guys are reporting in Richmond. So I feel your pain out there near the bay. Uh, wind gusts right now in the 20s, but again, they could be higher out there. As we go into the afternoon, maybe 2, 3, 4 o'clock, we could see 30 and maybe even the mid to upper 30s for parts of the northern neck middle peninsula as we go into these afternoon hours today. So just something to be careful of and that's going to of course push back and pile up some of that water along the bay. So we've got some flood advisories for you folks two to three feet above normal and this could last tonight, tomorrow, maybe even into very early Thursday morning. There's a look at the radar scope. Yeah, kicking up now. Here we go. Radar scope has some light showers here in Richmond and a little more steady down around Petersburg and Dinwiddie about to scoot into Chesterfield, southern Chesterfield County and uh, Colonial Heights into that area. And you can see the big picture, some of those showers coming out of North Carolina having effect on some of us here in town. There you go, South Hill and Emporia seeing some rain showers also. That's the big picture and that's the pattern we'll be in for the next few days. Heavier rain though, you can see way in the corner there coming out of uh, Charlotte and those will affect southwestern Virginia and that's where the heaviest rain has been and will continue to be. The broad upper level low is now in central Indiana, and we still have a circulation around uh, Arthur way out there at the sea. So we're getting that northeasterly flow of air that's keeping us chilly, cloudy, and breezy today. In the meantime, we're getting some of these showers. So just a few showers. We're not expecting a lot of heavy rain here in town, just scattered showers. They should be fairly light. The heaviest rain is going to stay down to the south and southwest. Now, later tonight and tomorrow, those showers are going to pick up a little bit into tomorrow morning. But look at that heavy rain, still south and southwest. Periods of showers will be with us on and on, off and on into the day on Thursday. Even into Friday, we can still see a few showers. We start to warm up, though, latter part of the week, 77 by Friday, 80s for the weekend. And as of now, Sunday and Monday look to be dry.